So many times as a little boy, I sat and watched and marveled and daydreamed of how someday I'd like to be the man behind the wheel of a big truck, hearing the sound of their mighty motors as they roar down the road. Well, that dream never came true for me. Yet, though now I'm a man, I've done my share of travel. And now, many years later, I still get that feeling of power and command every time I see a big truck go by. Now, each man has a talent, and though my talent didn't follow my daydreams, I still admire the talent of that man behind the wheel. You just think for a minute what it takes to handle one of those big rigs. It takes judgment, timing, being alert. Courtesy, strength, and a whole lot of determination. Truck driving is really a world of its own, and sometimes it's a lonely world. Being away from home for days or weeks at a time. I've met a lot of these men, and believe me, they're a special kind of men. They're the men who have families and are dedicated to their homes. And then there are the men who don't have families, men who just love the road and like to be on the go. It gives them that untied feeling, free, going somewhere, seeing new places and new faces. A pretty waitress, maybe, uh, listening to a jukebox while he's having coffee and pie, and well, in some truck stop a long, long way from home. And you know something? That man behind the wheel lives by a code, unwritten perhaps, but it's a code just the same. And that is that the man behind the wheel watches over the lives of everyone he meets on our highways. You probably remember a story in the newspapers a short time ago about the truck driver who overturned his truck in a ditch. Given his life to keep from hitting a little girl who had darted across the road in front of him. Yes, we all owe the man behind the wheel a salute. Just look how the truck has helped build this great land of ours, and the man who drives that truck might be the man next door. He might be your sister Sally's boyfriend, or he just might be your uncle Jim. Anyway, if he's a truck driver, he's a very important part of America's way of life—the man behind the wheel. <laughs>